Hi, in this video, we'll take a look at how you can set up your iPhone 8 uh, for the first time use. So you can uh, press on the power button on the side here, press and hold, and you can uh, turn on the phone. Once it is turned on, you should uh, put in the SIM card. So on the side here, there is a SIM tray. Just push it in and then insert the SIM card. You may need to uh, follow your provided instruction to uh, activate the SIM card. If the SIM card is already activated, you can uh, just simply put it in and start using it. Now once you see the hello screen, just press on the home button. And from the list here, choose a language that you want to use. So I'm going to choose English. And go down and select a region that you want to use. So set setting language. Next, tap on set up manually. Then tap on a Wi-Fi network that you are using and then we're going to put in the Wi-Fi password and then tap on the join button on the keyboard and here we're going to join into that Wi-Fi network so we're just waiting for it to connect to the Wi-Fi so it's an incorrect password so we'll try it again Okay, next, after the phone has successfully connected to our network, it will try to activate the phone. So just give it a minute or two for it to activate the iPhone. Okay, on the next screen, tap on the continue button. At this point, you can also set up your fingerprint if you wanted to so simply tap and hold onto your home screen button or home button then tap on continued and then it will finish tap on continued and here we can create a passcode and when you tap on use anyway it said this uh, passcode is too simple In here, you can choose how you want to um, backup or, and restore your data. So you can restore from iCloud backup. So on, if you have an iPhone, an older iPhone, and you have backup, backed them up to the, uh, the cloud, you can uh, choose restore from iCloud backup. You can restore from a PC or a Mac, transfer directly from an iPhone. You can move data from Android or don't transfer. In this example, I want to choose don't transfer apps and data. And here you will have a chance to put in your Apple ID. Uh, this will allow you to uh, use uh, app stores when you sign in you can use app store itunes and other services so put in your apple id if you don't want to put in your apple id now you can do it at a later stage so you can tap on uh, forgot password or don't have an apple id in here you can uh, create a new apple id or you can try to uh, retrieve the forgotten password from your Apple, your old Apple ID or you can tap on set up later in settings and tap on don't use and later in settings you can manually set up your Apple ID I'm just going to tap on I agree and tap on continued in here iMessage and FaceTime so so people can contact you on all your devices uh, with iMessage and FaceTime using your phone number and email address so if you want to use iMessage and FaceTime, you can tap on continued. And do you want to turn on location services? If yes, tap on enable location services. Then tap on continued. And say, say here, hey Siri. Hey Siri, send a message. Hey Siri, how's the weather today? Hey Siri, set a timer for three minutes. Hey Siri, play some music. So that is how we can set up Siri and then on continued. And here we've got screen time. So if you want to use screen time, you can turn it on. Otherwise we can uh, uh, skip it. So set up later and then tap on don't share, tap on continued, continued and get started. So choose your click, so you can choose this click here, this one here, or this one here. Decide how you want to uh, just tap on uh, each of the different ones and then try it. So as you choose the first one, it will be harder to press. You have to press a bit harder. 
Uh, number two is the medium, you can just press it gently and number three is the easiest, you can uh, press it the most gently to uh, press on the button. Now select one of the options and tap on next. In here you can choose the display zoom. So select which one you want to use and tap on continue, then tap on get started. And I think the phone just uh, ran out of battery so we have hit the home screen. Oh no it's not, it just um, black out temporarily. So here I'm going to put in the screen passcode to access the home screen. And if I go into settings and go into general about, you can see the software version that I'm running now is 13.1.3. And this is iOS 13 and this is what it looks like. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Uh, please subscribe to my channel for more videos.